It was the greatest glass company in the world. You'll learn a little bit about that here. I haven't even seen this one yet. Now, I'm a little confused here because these, to me, look like Steuben pieces. Now, I know a lot of people say Steuben, but it's really Steuben. So we're talking with Peter Yenowin, crystal designer extraordinaire. Why are we looking at Steuben pieces? Through probably some intervention from above, I was fortunate enough to leave school and take a job with Steuben wow. as my first job out of design wow. school. Steuben is considered, was considered the best in the world. And so it was just extraordinary to leave school and go to the best in the world. Yes. And so it was very, very important to me and they allowed me to go at my own pace. Uh, I really didn't have a boss from six months in and I'm a rather prolific designer so I could go and as, as soon as I could get as many new designs through the craftsman's hands and get them making them uh, correctly then I'd go up to the research labs at Corning which was a student was a division of Corning Glass and work on new applications and processes which has gotten me to today with our own factory. So so tell me about this piece though this is a Steuben piece that Peter Yenowin designed. No uh, this is yes the caterpillar was the number one selling animal for years wow and that created by these little spheres because of, on the center of a table everyone across from you will be inverted in each one of these candlelight inverted so the sphere is just this magical thing within crystal so the caterpillar was actually a serious work of art but because Steuben had a sense of humor I was able or Arthur Houghton did I was able to do it as a legitimate product. Nice. This Tell me. is because Steuben has closed. It closed a year ago October for unfortunately. It was very, very sad. And so we've had so many calls for because people knew I designed for them for seven years that can we do Steuben for them? And our response is no, we will not do, re reproduce Steuben. You're not going to reproduce? No. But I will put on my steuben -ish hat. And so I've been, uh, because our factory our, here in Bethlehem is all a cold fabrication. We cut, grind, and polish. Cold. Cold, yes. yes. So I've been able to put on my Steuben hat, go work with studio artists, and create a Steuben feel, which is the hot molten glass. And this is my brand new trillium bowl, which I'm very excited about. And the first people who saw it said, I thought Steuben closed. So I apparently still have some of the Steuben-ish blood in me and uh, I was forever grateful for the career they launched for me. And, uh, so uh, Steuben has closed, Peter Yenowin is still here. <laughs> and very much alive and well, <laughs> so, and can't wait to hear from you. You see how that's a bumper style video that we're using again? The front and back, sending places. Uh, how many years was Peter Yenowin the uh, designer at Steuben? Seven years. See, we picked this up. You now, guys, you guys are paying attention. Thank yeah. you very much. Yes, I appreciate it again. <laughs> we really appreciate your attention. Thank you very much. Thank you.